you can fucking do it. Oh, good morning. Happy Saturday the 9th of April. I have literally just woken up, had a wee and weighed myself since. Why well, I literally look like I've just woken up because I have. I woke up about eight minutes ago. Uh, it is officially the show day vlog again. I am so excited this morning. Oh my gosh. I slept so badly last night. I've literally slept for like five hours. I was up until about half three just because I couldn't sleep. Just like vibing to myself, listening to music, making a banging car playlist, just like having the time of my life. Um, I've dropped weight again this morning, which is just insane considering I slept for like five hours. I'm going to sleep so well tonight because I've got so much to do today. But yeah, just general like absolute buzz on today. Oh my gosh, I can't believe it. I can't believe we're here. Yeah, feeling good. So this morning I need to get 80 grams of porridge in me. And then we're going to go get some bits and bobs done while well, I need to shave because obviously the hair and your cream was shit yesterday. Um, yeah, I've got loads of things to do. I have no idea what order I'm going to get them done in, but follow along. So, yeah, I'll see you in a bit. Hey, guys, just mapped out my calories for the day. My room has literally descended into chaos, but I am so happy with the weight that I've lost. Like, there's still a little bit more to go for next week, but like, oh, I just look so much better than last time like so much better i honestly i can't get over how much better i look lines finally <laughs> finally my bottom half is catching up it's so good yeah i'll um i'll do a proper physique update when i get to the hotel later i'm a very happy girl i've just had uh 80 grams of oats so i'm very happy Pl mapped out all of my macros for the day Kind of. Still got 60 grams of carbs to get in. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it yet, but I might treat myself to some granola. I'm not sure. I need something that's like easily digestible. So I'm not going for bread or anything like that. Anything that's going to like shock my system. Just shit that I eat all the time, <laughs> basically. So oats, which isn't a problem because you all know how much I love oats. So uh, yeah, get my bag sorted and be back with you soon. I've caved. We're finally doing it. Going to get the eyebrows done. They're a hot mess, so it's got to be done. <laughs> the only point that I could get was 11.25 and it's like half 10 now, so I'm going to see if I can get in any earlier. If not, I'll just go somewhere else. And um, I'll tell you what, one more thing I'm getting used to is just vlogging in public. Like, I was really shy about it at first, and now I just don't really care. <laughs> just carrying these bad boys through the high street as well. <laughs> I believe it's tomorrow. Ah, much better, like a new woman. <laughs> so they got me in a little bit early, which was good. So I shouldn't have even had my foot right now. I'm already off to um to pump, which is good. Looking forward to it. I've just realised as well that I'm peaking for my next show. So <laughs> I'm one day out from one show and seven days out from another because the two roads is literally next Saturday. Um, oh, the wind. I don't know if you can hear me anymore, but um, I'm just speaking a bit louder. <laughs> but yeah, so I'm just so happy with how we're coming in for this one. I can't believe it like that. Two and a half kilos has been so much different. And hopefully, if we manage to get a little bit more off by next week, I'll actually feel pe peeled enough to uh, get on a two bros stage. But I mean, we're doing it regardless, so it doesn't really matter, does it? But yeah, let's uh, let's go get pumped up, and I'll see you on the other side. Oh, it is done. I'm officially pumped and ready to go. Oh my god, I'm literally so excited. I've just had my final little like pose in the studio. Kind of like have a look at my routine. Feeling good. I don't want to overthink it because I know what I'm doing. I'm just um, in panic mode, but like totally relaxed at the same time. It's really weird. Maybe I'm a little bit too relaxed. Who knows? But yeah, feeling feeling so good. Need to go home now and get another bowl of oats in and um, hit the road. Oh my god. <sighs> Back home now, I'm just making my second bowl of porridge, which is 60 grams of oats. No protein in this one. And it's weird making oats without any protein in because I'm not used to it. <laughs> so to get like a thicker consistency, I mixed up boiling water, soy milk, and a handful of frozen berries just to make like a weird kind of like smoothie milk thing. And then I'm just gonna eat it out of the pan, like I always do. What a great day for oats, I love it. Oh, uh, that's it. I'm in the car. I think I've got everything. Fuck up protein, scales, rice, everything you think of. Oh, I think I've got it. I think I have. Let's just go. Oh, God. I'll see you in Kent, I think. Or maybe a services, who knows. Oh, 
Oh my god, I've just stopped in the services. I think it's called like Wyndham or something. I'm not really sure. It's fucking huge anyway, and I've definitely been here before. But it's absolutely heaving. There is no way I'm stopping for a coffee in there. Like everyone in his fucking dog is in there. And now I can't find a car. <laughs> Where did I park? Literally, I have no idea. I've never been so happy to see my fucking car in my life. I actually thought that someone had robbed it. But the fact is, it's just. <laughs> It's just loads of cars. I was like, where's it gone? We found it. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Right. Standard room and bail. Here we go. Ooh. Okay. That's huge. No mirror. Goodness for that. Oh my gosh. So we need to catch up on what just happened. Oh, choice of two big beds. I mean, it's clean and whatever. I'm definitely going to go and have a glass of wine on tonight. Little old me. Oh, it does the job, doesn't it? Hey. So I just had literally like the biggest palaver getting here. Mm, I'm so annoyed. I'll tell you about it in a second. Oh my God. So I had like the biggest palaver getting here. So the fucking hotel is behind some gates, right? That look like they're just kind of like, you can't drive through them and you have to have a code to get in. And I just, it's on either side of the M25. And I literally drove around for like 40 minutes trying to get in. I'm, like, I'm not even joking. I drove through little villages, through country lanes, here, there and everywhere. Oh, so annoyed. But we're here now. Room. I can't believe I've got such a big room, which is quite nice because I can like practice my walk and shit. <laughs> it's not my walk, it's a tea walk. But yeah, I'm just gonna settle in, have some food, make the beds, freak out. I've got to go get to town in two hours, three hours, so I've got loads of time, which is good because I want to just chill for a bit. <laughs> Life and some wine. <laughs> oh my god, what a nightmare. <laughs> we made it now, that's fine. <sighs> I brought so much with me, but I think, like, just be safe and sorry. It's not even nice coffee, but, you know, I just thought, bring your own coffee. Squash, oats, tiny dribble of soy milk, creatine, selection of proteins. There's some rice in there, more rice if I need it. I think I've got three of those just in case. Sauces to decorate things. Jam, mm. salad, it's just not been in the fridge, but it doesn't matter, I don't care. Chucky. Salted caramel wraps. Can you tell that I'm an so annoyed by that journey? And then just, oh gosh, I'm so annoyed. <laughs> I'm gonna have a little, a little woosa time. I think <laughs> I just need to kind of. Ooh. Okay, I've calmed down a bit now. <laughs> I've had some food, relaxed a bit. I need to make the bed, but that's fine. Um, I'm riding solo this weekend. I don't know if I mentioned that actually. I'm here by myself. I've actually really been looking forward to it. I feel like I'm on a little like solo girls trip, if that makes any sense. And I'm just enjoying some time to myself. It's really nice. Um, I'm doing everything DIY for this show. So like doing my own hair, I mean, doesn't really take much effort. Doing my own hair, doing my own makeup. I'm doing my own nails. I couldn't get my shellacs off from last time. So I'm just gonna paint over the top of them. I've got a color that's basically the same. And then I'm just gonna put some glitter up at the top. And when I show you the suit, um, it'll make sense. But yeah, so um, yeah, Ike's got his own uh, amateur championships tonight. He's, it's the quarterfinal, I think. So he's on in like <clears throat> an hour. They normally run, run late. So I'm, I'm watching the live stream. But yeah, he's uh, trying to defend his national amateur super heavyweight champion belt tonight. So quarterfinal and then obviously um, in for tomorrow. So that's exciting if he gets in tomorrow, which he will. So that's exciting. So yeah, we're both competing this weekend. I think this is going to be the first of many times when we have um, competitions on the same day, which is hilarious. But um, yeah, I hope he's okay. It's weird, like not going to watch. 
Yeah. And I've not done a competition without him there because I've only done one, so it's interesting. But yeah. But full video is coming, which should be nice. So yeah, I'm gonna paint my nails and carry on chilling. <laughs> Amazing. Oh, right. Time for me to go and get fucking tanned. Yeah, baby. Hi, so I've just parked up and I'm off to go and get my tan, and it is literally freezing. How nice is this light, though? Oh, that's beautiful. Yeah, I need to go and get bronze. I'm fucking freezing. I always do this to myself. I'm like, oh, I want to pack lights, so I'm gonna take a fuck all with me. And I didn't bring a coat, I didn't bring joggers, nothing. So it's my own fault, really, isn't it? And I've parked way far down the road. I thought it was gonna be heaving, but it's not. So I'm just wandering the streets of Brothers and freezing. It's great, I love it. Wow, that wasn't too traumatic. Layer number one is on, you can't really tell, uh, just because it's dark. Um, and I <laughs> I just remembered how traumatic it is to um, have a wee. And I didn't bring a she wee with me, which is moderately annoying. So uh, that's fun. And I actually quite need a piss, but... Anyway, I'm gonna go try and find some wine because I, I want a glass of wine tonight. If I could find like one of those little ones, you know, the ones that you can only put like you only get one glass out of to like control myself, that'd be great. So yeah, I'm gonna try and find a shop and um, then go back and eat my rice. We are back. I just had a danger pee and it went quite well, I think. Not as dark as I was expecting. I mean, it is the first layer, but yeah. Feeling good, feeling good. Oh my gosh. And also look what I found. Sorry for the video, but I'm doing it. Tied a little bundle of wine. So I'm going to, oh God, I can't believe we're doing it again. I can't believe we're doing it again. I just look so much better this time. I can't get over it. Anyway, I'm going to eat my rice and have some wine. Good morning. <laughs> you know what day it is. It's show day. I have um, a salad in the sink, by the way. I'm trying to keep it cold. I've already peed down my leg, which is moderately really annoying. Hopefully they can fix all their shit. Feeling good. <clears throat> Slept well. Feeling a bit, I don't know, a bit flat this morning. We'll see. Into the unknown we go. It's, it's weird, because like last time I knew people, whereas this time I literally don't, I don't know anyone really, so. I literally am walking into the unknown. Anyway, I'm gonna make my Ban Marie porridge like I did last time. <laughs> um, I have just weighed the lowest I have ever weighed throughout this entire prep. <laughs> what? <laughs> I'm 65.8 kilos. So this is my genius idea. You basically just put something over the sink, in the sink even, so that it doesn't leak out, and then make a bummer but it's obviously leaking out because look how much water's in there. <laughs> but I mean, it's better than nothing, I suppose. I don't know. It's not the same. <laughs> it's 60 grams, right? 60 grams of protein in down the hatch. We go. Okay, oats are in. And as you know, just dragging a chair. Um, I'm gonna be doing my own makeup. I'm not a makeup artist, so don't at me, okay? I'm not very good at it. I'm just gonna take this mirror <laughs> off the wall. <laughs> and we're gonna put it in the window. And um, we're gonna hope for the best, basically. But now I need to rest all my contact lenses in, so let's try and, try and get this done.
Okay, so I know I've literally just done my eyeshadow, but I'm kind of regretting doing my makeup now. <laughs> Advice. Just pay to get it done. We'll carry on, but. <laughs> So I am like by no stretch the am uh, by no stretch the imagination a makeup artist, and I'm certainly not Danielle Spencer. I've missed her today, <laughs> but I did my own, and I'm actually like quite impressed with myself. Oh, okay, that's great. It's not great, but I'm quite happy with that. Yay! Definitely uh, got time for another coffee. I need to brush my teeth. I still haven't decided how I want my hair. I might wear it up, so I need to sort my edges out. <clears throat> Also, I've like dribbled all down my legs, not piss obviously, but like water, which is very annoying. Right, that's it. I've faffed enough. I've done it. I've packed. That's going in the car. Coming with, coming with, coming with shoes, obviously. Gonna live in the car. Oh my God. Let's go. I'm so excited now. Just waiting for layer number two now. The guy said my makeup looked really nice, so I was like, oh, well, thank you, because I did it on my fingers when I left. <laughs> it's not bad, huh? I still don't know what I'm going to do with my hair, but we'll see. Hi, guys. So I'm just strutting around backstage, trying to work out which bikini I'm going to wear. I think I've decided, though. And I also think I'm going to wear my hair up. Something a bit different. Why not? Get my shoulders out. Strutting around in my shoes, just having a wee little practice, but I feel so good, honestly, I feel so good for this show. Um, I'm so glad that my weight's come off, like, I can't believe it, my legs look great in the tan, like, I'm just on it. We're on it, I'm making friends already, yay! Didn't know there was a flash on, but that's fine, so we're just having a look at the stage for the first Hi. time. Oh. So, where am I? Damn, honey. I am like actually buzzing now. I can't believe it. We made it. Oh, hey team. So we've just come off stage and I've made a new friend, Ruby. How freaking gorgeous is she? Um, she's providing me with some alcohol because, um, well, boss hasn't said that I can have any alcohol, but I am. So sorry, Fulvio, I'm getting my glass of wine. I said it was okay, so. Ruby said it was okay. So we're, um, we're doing like, I feel like a 15 year old again. Slightly soon I'm 15. Good time to shake. Still got the stage shakes. Literally, we've got stage shakes. Yeah. It was so much fun though, wasn't it good? It was good. There well, was a lot of us. There was a lot of us. This, but this is Bikini Open just now. Thank you so much for welcome. Um, we just did Bikini Open and um, have you got another one? Is that you done? No, that's me done. Yeah. That's done. done, yeah. I've got um, beginner in like an hour, so we're going to go out for some fresh air and a uh, we'll drink and gym mm. wag. It's going to be fucking great. I'll see you in a minute. Hi everyone, we're back in the car now. It's done, the whole thing is done, woo! I'm so glad. <laughs> I can't wait to get home and scrub this fucking tunnel. Um, I didn't vlog too much when I was there just because like, it wasn't really the vibe. It's been a bit of a weird day to be honest. Like, it wasn't the best vibes backstage. Like, sorry if anyone that was there is watching this, but it was just like, it was just a bit dead to be honest. Like, I placed uh, fourth and fifth, so I'm like, bit meh about that perhaps I'm not what um this federation's looking for um maybe I just didn't bring a very good package who knows I'll wait for feedback I'm obviously a little bit bummed out but um you know it's all good practice for the big boy next weekend uh, again I'm not actually expecting to place next weekend either because I don't think I'm going to be lean enough but we'll see won't we but um yeah I'm glad I did it it was an experience um yeah, I just can't wait to get home. Um, but yeah, it's finished. I'll see you in a bit. Oh my God, I've been driving around for so long trying to find a fucking McDonald's in a service station that isn't absolutely heaving. I've stopped in three and I couldn't find one. But I've finally given in because um, I'm literally like so desperate for a coffee that it's actually a fucking piss take. So I'm gonna see what burger King has to offer. 
probably gonna be shit, but whatever. And I need um, like some sort of decongestion as well because I feel horrendously um, constipated. Oh, I've been to this services before as well. I love playing that game. Have you been to this services? Come to a service station. Oh, I'm a costa. Oh, okay. Right, let's go and see what Burger King has. I know how I was saying I'm constipated. I've done a really naughty thing. I've got a double vegan royale. So I've got two patties. Oh, Went large with this thing. And large fries. Oh my god, I'm fucking buzzing. It's not even that nice, but it's just naughty, so I'll take it. Get me chops around this. Okay, it's pretty good. It could do with some spice. If it was zinger, I'd be down with it. She's playing. Pretend you're stuffing chops. Oh. Oh my god. I'm scared. I'm scared to pull them off. <laughs> Anyway, we're home. We're back. I'm so glad to be back. I'm literally so glad to be back. I'm so tired. Um, I am going to jump in the bath and try and scrub all of this off, this situation, this situation, and try and get nice and clean and get into bed because it's, well, it's peak week again and uh, we've got the tea bros next Saturday, which I'm so pumped about. I'm just using this, um, this experience. I mean, I've got two top five placings. Like, I can't be mad about it. I'm really pleased. It was a... Um, just such a different lineup. Um, it was a tea walk. It, there was lots of things that I just it isn't wasn't me. But like I'm not making excuses. You know I didn't. You know I placed top five, so I can't be I can't be mad. A little bit disappointed, obviously, but not like you know. It's a learning experience, isn't it? It's all stage experience. So I'm really grateful for the experience. The girl who won was like awesome. My actual soul sister Kelly. We got on so well. She's just like a dream. She was so funny. You know when you spot someone, you're like. I'm gonna vibe with you. So yeah, very glad to be back. I'm gonna get into the bath and relax, put some shit on Amazon and just zone out for a little bit. And um, hit legs tomorrow, back to peak week protocol for the big boy. Boom! I definitely think that I'm more suited to like PCA and two bros. They're my, um, I think other federations that I suit, no hate to any other federation, but they're the two I think that are most to me. So they're the ones I'll carry on with. Anyway, thank you so much for watching this vlog. It's going to be so long. I'm going to have a lot of fun editing this. <laughs> but yeah, thank you so much for watching and all of your support, the Instagram messages at Laura Tippett Bussy. Thanks for using my protein code for the protein works, not my protein. My protein works code. My protein code. <laughs> uh, which currently is a PWBLT. 10% off sale on top of sale and thank you for just like supporting me in general I genuinely it genuinely like means the absolute world to me I can't even explain I get a little bit overwhelmed sometimes with all the messages I really do but like I every I read every single one and I'm so so grateful I promise you I could not do it without you guys supporting me like it means the entire world and I will see you in the next one <laughs>